We've arrived at Warrel Tea Beach. Let's go check it out. Warrel Tea Beach is approximately two hours and 21 minutes from LA CBD, around about 200 kilometers. To get there, you need to head down Warrel Tea Beach Road. Also, to get supplies, you can go to Port Victoria or some of the other neighboring towns. And we noticed on the drive in, there was some corrugation on the road. So bear that in mind when you go down this way. You will need a permit to stay here. So check the information and get that permit before you stay. We didn't find any bins, so please take your rubbish with you. Phone reception on Telstra is 4G. Others are around 3G. All the sites here are non-powered and there is a water tank, but it's not suitable for drinking. This campground is split into two sections, one in front of the dunes and one on the beach. The ones in front of the dunes don't have as much wind. In this first section, there are two main areas of camping, just as you come in and a little bit further down. And these are the closest to the toilet and water tank. When we see the sites in more detail, let's go check out the toilet. The inside of the toilet was clean, roomy, had a running tap, and it was stocked. If you want to camp right next to the toilet, this site is the best place for you. It is flat, roomy, there's no fire pit. So you'll have to bring your own and wood and just on the fires you can't have fires inside fire danger season make note this campground is pet friendly moving on to the next site this is quite a large space so quite a few people can set up here and as you can probably tell, you can fit any kind of camping platform. Let's move on to the next section. This spot is another large space that can accommodate quite a number of campers with any platform. If you see that path, it's actually fenced off so you can't get beach access from there. Now that part's done, let's make our way to the beach sites. Welcome to Warrelty Beach. At first glance, you can see how lovely this place is and why people choose to camp more so on this side. You can certainly see how easy it is to fit most platforms. There's plenty of room to turn and manoeuvre. In this particular section, there are three places you can camp. What you're looking at right in front of you, which is quite flat and has a stunning view. As long as there's an opening, you can pitch up. And also another section down the side here and actually on the beach. Down this stretch, the sites are actually clearly defined. They're all quite roomy, nice and relatively level. Now if you read the sign, it says that you should walk down this part to see if there's spots available because you may not be able to turn around.
This particular site has steps that go down to the beach. But bear in mind, people are also camping on the beachfront there. But just a reminder, these are the furthest away from the water tank and the toilet. At the end of this stretch, there's a place where you can turn your vehicle around. And finally, let's head to the beach and have a look. The drive onto the beach is quite straightforward, but keep in mind, it is a bit steep. So if your caravan's riding low, you may scratch a little bit or struggle to get on. But once you're on, it's quite hard sand. If you recall the first beach site we showed you, there is beach access. And this is why you come here for this kind of beach camping. It is amazing. And look, as long as you're in front of the tide line, you can camp up pretty close to the cliffs here and enjoy your stay. Wild Tea Beach campground, look at it. Beautiful, lots of space. Make sure you camp along the sand dunes on the beach. Up the top there, there's clearly marked sites. Don't forget about the permit. There's toilets. Have a look, come down and check it out. And remember, camp by me and you'll be a happy camper. Now don't forget to check out our social media. Just search for Camp By Me and also on YouTube. Follow and subscribe, it's free. It's a wall, it's not wall tree, it's wall tea. tea. Wall, like a golf tea. Okay, Whirl sorry, tea. just again. And what? don't say witness. <laughs> I know, can I no. get a witness? No, no. okay. Right, Anna, it's. Dave, is that a typo? Wall tree beach? Wall tree beach? Wall tea? I'm so confused! Doesn't matter. We're gonna go with the big one. Okay. Let's go check it out.